Alright boys, let's make a video. Yo, what's up boys, and welcome to another Armor Free video. This time showing off a game mode which you would have seen a few months ago, maybe a few years ago, who the fuck knows. I made it on Armor Free, I made it on Armor 2, it's Armor Free gun game. I just won this round because I'm nutty. Uh, my boy Optics, who made the Desolation mod for Armor Free and also the Rush mod for Armor Free, which you guys have probably seen in some of my videos in the past on that. He made this game mode for Tanoa just overnight and it works really good. So I thought I'd show you guys what it's like. All you need to do if you've got the Apex branch installed, which will be in annotation in the top right for the tutorial on how to do that. Once you've done that, just search for gun game in a filler and you'll find a server. And then you get to choose uh, the map and you get to try out all the different weapons which the Armor Free Apex expansion has to offer. So we'll go through every single one, getting bigger and bigger weapons until eventually uh, the game is over. Which in that case I won and I'm going to make it a two win streak right here boys. You ready to watch the ultimate gun game player? So the map which we're going to be clearly winning on today is the Blue Harb one. Just keep in mind the spawns on this. Oh shit! Okay, that's a perfect example. I was going to say the spawns on this are complete aids. They can be complete aids just because it's you know something which optics made very quickly but you can see the ui on the right is very sexy the kill feed on the left um and we will be able to show you all of the different iron sights for all of the new to know one weapons quick shout out by the way to me not being able to aim no quick shout out to armor rp.life for hosting the serve they're also the guys who host the my legs are broke i can't aim oh no i got him never mind i can't aim now i'm dead Okay, no, I'm not dead. I don't know how I just survived that. Also, the guys who host the current uh, Tanoa Cop series, which I play on. I don't know how the fuck I'm not dead. I don't know how much longer the series is going to go on. I said I was going to stop it today, but maybe with some changes when Apex eventually comes out. My game just for us. When Apex eventually comes out, the server will be more popular. You'll be able to ban people who are complete fucking idiots. But right now, since every life server is struggling... How do I aim with population? Like, we just can't ban anyone. I mean, you can ban people, but, you know, you need to keep uh, enough videos to keep people interested just from seeing how many people there is on the server. Also, that's Austin. I'm keep on killing over and over again. He's the guy who owns that community. Um, but, yeah, don't worry. This isn't just a camping kind of game. There's a few different maps. This one is definitely one of my least favorite. It reminds me of uh, Shipment on Call of Duty 4. Shout out to Call of Duty 4 coming back in 2016. I'm dead. Okay. Yeah. Uh, doing a live commentary on this is hard. But, yeah, there's definitely better maps out there. What the f Okay, that spawn is terrible. That's what I'm talking about for 8 spawns. I think I would have preferred very much so to play on the Ruins map. I've never played that before and it just sounds cool to... Uh, buy. It sounds like a cool idea to fight people in the Aztec Ruins on Tanoa as opposed to just going around in these very simple maps. Like, this is just squares and shit. If I start the video, you would have seen me playing on Georgetown, which... Um, I did actually lose that game, so I just got fucking wrecked. I did say I was going to win um, the game after. That was the game after. But don't worry, the game after after, which is this one right here, I'm going to totally win this one. So you see some of the iron sights for weapons, which I didn't show you guys in the weapon showcase. Because a few of you said come, a few of you left comments saying, yo, I want to see the iron sights, and you were showing the new scope over and over again. So this is the car 95 5.8mm. It's a decent rifle. I don't know how these people on kill me earlier, but it's pretty much on the same level as the Katiba. This is the Type 105, which I don't like the iron sights, but it works, it works. Look at that fucking quick scope. This is the Spa, it's got a beautiful drum mag on it. it was, I don't know, all the new weapons I really like the look of. Like, they all, don't look too futuristic or anything, they sound cool, they look cool. You'll see the RPG layer, the grenade launcher, you'll see the machine gun, which I did not show off in that video. Which is also pretty cool, because it's got two different firing modes. It's got a fast fire, and a quick fire, which I think some people might not realise. The only weapon which, unfortunately, is not in this game mode right now, which I'll tell Optics to add it, um, is the... Uh, the underbarrel 50 cal, which I forgot which weapon has it, but it's got like a normal. How the fuck did he survive that long? Maybe you've got like spawn protection, so spawns are that but yeah, they've definitely need some work. Fuck. But it's not one of the worst. But yeah, adding the 50 cal underbarrel as an option on top of having the normal, like 762, I think the rifle is. It might be this rifle right here, but it's false 17. There we go. This rifle's pretty nice as well, 762. Got some pretty decent iron sights, but I think this one, or maybe another one, has got an underbarrel. It's definitely an assault rifle, it's got an underbarrel attachment, like 10 rounds per mag in the underbarrel. So you've got 10 50 cal shots have underbarrel, and then like 20 762 shots from above. I don't know which weapon it is, so sorry if I'm wrong, but the point is there's a 50 cal underbarrel on a normal assault rifle, which is just so fucking. Oh, I've got eyes, congrats to me. So weird to see. So this is a grenade launcher right here. Um, this is kind of hard to do. Sometimes it depends. Like, I'm keep on looking like behind me like really quickly. I don't know how ugly this is gonna be for a video. Okay, that was too close to explode. Fuck. I learned this in Call G4. Wondering why does it not explode? Need to shoot a bit more far away. I'm gonna assume 
He's... Oh, never mind. Let's kill that dude instead. Okay, that's perfect. There he is. And he's dead. So this is a call 98 5.8. Did I want to use this? I don't actually know. What the fuck? Okay, that was embarrassing, but don't worry, I killed him. You can see I've got one out of two kills on the right side. I'm afraid I can make multiple game, gun game uh, videos. I mean, I will if you guys want me to, but... Jesus fucking him. I don't see why you would. This is a CMR. I don't know if I've used this before. No, I haven't. It sounds sexy. It's 7... You know, it's not 762. It's 6.5, but it sounds awesome. It's semi auto It doesn't go full auto I don't think. I don't even fucking know. I don't really care. I'm going to use a semi anyway. It's got a built-in bipod. But the reason I'm not going to make multiple games gun game videos is because, um, I don't know, it's just impossible to do these fucking commentaries. I'm on crack cocaine right now, and who would want to watch me kill people over and over again? At the end of the day, it's just you going around killing people and trying to win the gun game. I could try on a different maps if you want, but it is going to be the same weapons over and over again. Optics might change it in the future. This weapon's kind of shit long range. It's a submachine gun. AKS-74U. Also from Call of Duty 4. What the fuck? Oh, hello. And I'm dead. Okay, I don't know. Did I kill that guy? Yeah, I did, but it still says zero... Uh, kills out of two, whatever. I'll be fine. I think I'm doing pretty good. I don't know if I'm winning right now. Like, there's nothing too obvious on the screen in regards to that. But you guys will see compared to the gun game we're seeing. What the fuck? Okay, uh, I'll take it. Where was this guy? Oh, he's on the right. Okay, cool. I was just shooting at, like, I don't know, something. But yeah, as opposed to the gun game you would have seen in Armour 2 ages ago and Armour 3, considering optics made it so quickly, it's pretty well made. I'm not sure if it's something which we're gonna want to, or optics wants to have, like, I don't know, popularized on Armour. Like, you could have, like, a dedicated host which just hosts gun game servers, and would people join them? I don't know, I know there's a few Altus Armour 3 ones, and that's why you're ADS boys. There's a few Altus Armour 3 ones which are pretty popular. Uh, but Optics is trying to look for a host right now to host these servers, which I'd say are pretty good to, you know, warm you up for the armor-free aiming. If you haven't played with the new to know weapons, how is this 762 is so shit? Oh, it's two people. Okay, he's dead. But yeah, it's pretty good to get you warmed up with them. Or if you haven't used for to know weapons yet, then yeah, this is perfect. It allows you to use all of them, but of course that one that we talked about before. So that was the AKM. Next up, we've got the... I don't actually know, but we need one kill with it. Oh, it's a grenade launcher. I don't know what this gun even is, but we need a grenade launcher someone. Um... Holy shit, I don't know how you can kill that guy. I heard sounds, I thought he was there. This is the AK-12762. Got a pretty cool iron sight. I like this one. It does seem to be, I don't know, like a decent uh, sword rifle. You can put attachments on it. Some of the AKs you can't. I forgot which one. I think it might be the AK. See, it kills people, man. Might have been the AKS-74U or could have been the AKM. I think it was the AK. I don't fucking know. I'm not going to say anything because I might be wrong. But after I get one more kill... I'm going to use my ears to work out where the next person is. Okay, I don't hear anything. We are going to show off the machine gun, which is 5.56. Five, it's not high caliber. Shut up, dog. Alright, now I've got a machine gun, which you guys have never seen in this video. This is the LIM. It's got the fast mode and the uh, slow mode. You'll see in the top right, it's got like less bars or more bars. Depending on I know you guys can't even hear me right now, but yeah, it's got like, less bars with a slow mode like this. Or it's got more bars if it's quick firing. And this is for RPG uh, 7. Which, it's a, it's a, it's, it's how much, I, 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 it shoots people, I don't know how I'm alive. Oh, double kill, there we go, beautiful. And finally, we've got the PM9mm to finish off gun game, which is, it, it normally progresses up and up and up, and you've got a shit thing right at the end, which is kinda hard to kill people with, but, I just killed two people? I think, I don't fucking know, all I know is I won. Okay, so you can't really see too well, there we go. Uh, kills, 31, deaths, 11, level reached 18, last level required 18. I did amazing in that game. Okay, anyway, if you guys would like to see some more, then, I don't know, don't forget to comment subscribe my good stuff, and I'll see what I can do. I don't know how boring this has been to watch, but this has been a demonstration of all the new weapons, and showing you guys a cool gun game made by Optics, with sounds and everything, it's, it's pretty well made. But yeah, check out on the fellow gun game, thank you again boys for hosting the server, and I'll see you guys next time. Mission complete, bitch.